I have a story for you. This story has got everything. Revenge. Drugs. Greed. Ronald McDonald. Somebody went to the FBI and said, guess what's happening? The McDonald's Monopoly game was fixed. The Bureau thought it was just some BS story. Fast food fraud was not making any list of priorities. Are you kidding me? This is what makes my fun meter go. McDonald's Monopoly game gave millions of people a chance to win. But from 1989 to 2001, there were almost no legitimate million dollar winners. The FBI told us the game pieces are being stolen. McDonald's was shocked. Conversations on the wiretap were coming in. I'm hearing the name Uncle Jerry thrown around on the phone. We started focusing more on trying to figure out who he was. He's a freaking gangster. Uncle Jerry was getting the tickets and selling them to other people. This is a million dollar winning ticket, and he's got it in a Ziploc sandwich bag that's not even zip. Somebody offers you a million dollars, you're going to take it. <laughs> Unless you got to kill somebody, then you might not, you know, you might not be interested. But... We had eight original individuals, which turned into 53. The vast majority of these winners, they're good people. One of my biggest regrets has been involved in this McDonald's thing. Yeah. I just wanted a better life, and I feel like this couldn't come to me if it wasn't meant for me. I've lost everything. This thing wrecked so many people's lives. How much bigger can this get? And it would get bigger. How much further back could it go? And it would go back further. But things go wrong. They always do. You can get away with something over and over and over. You only got to be caught once. 